Okay, now it's time to discuss that motherfucker, Jeff Eisenberg, the brother-in-law. When I moved in with my father, I went to check on his laptop. As you can see, the touch pad was coming up. Also at the time, the keyboard was very warped. I'd never seen anything like that. I've worked on computers many years, Wall Street 25 years, structured credit, US dollar derivatives, worked on computers all my life. And you know what? I couldn't get this laptop working. I spent two weeks, tried everything. It was running Windows 10, couldn't get it working. Um, maybe it's an act of desperation, but I decided to open up the laptop. Remember, it wasn't used all that much. And you know what I found? First, I found that the computer just popped open after I took the screws out. And then I found, more importantly, this guy, Jeff Eisenberg, and let me uh, set this up a little differently here took out the battery and replaced it. This is not the original battery. I don't know what kind it is, but he took out the Asus battery. That is why the touchpad was no longer sitting flush. That is why the keyboard was warped. That is why the computer would only hold a charge from 10 to 15 minutes, but it gets worse. Anyone who knows computers, and I think at this point most of us should, know that RAM is very important. Random access memory. It was missing. So what this guy did, knowing my father was more or less incapable of using this computer for a number of reasons. He changed the battery and took out the RAM. When I told people, they asked me whether I was sure. Am I sure? Oh shit, you can't see it. When I told people, no one gave a damn. They asked me if I was sure. Well, why ask me if I'm sure if it doesn't matter? I stumbled into this. I stumbled in to what was going on with my father. That's the problem. And when the facts are not on your side, you stay away from the facts and you pursue character assassination. It's amazing. 25 years on Wall Street, never accused of any, any impropriety, and all of a sudden I turn into a dishonest, crazy person. I don't give a shit what people think. I give a shit about what happened. It's an abomination.